Today's video is about how to add an image view in Android app. Here I have created an app named My Image View. In the XML file, we have a constraint layout and I'm deleting the default text view. To use an image view in the app, I have to add an image view to the drawable file. For that, I'm copying an image and pasting it in drawable file which comes under RIS folder. I'm going with the default destination directory. Name of this image is having a white space. As that will lead to an error, I'm removing that space and click on OK. Now image 2 is in drawable. Next I'm dragging image view from palette to the constraint layout in componentry. At that time you can see Pick a resource widget. From that, find the image which we have to use and click on OK. We can see the image is in the layout now. Now I'm adjusting the layout width and height by giving 400 dp. After that, I'm giving constraints to the bottom, top, end, and start. Now we can take a look at the XML code. We have a constraint layout. An image view inside that, then the layout width and layout height, the constraints, and path of image is given in app colon src compact. In design, you can see a warning as missing content description attribute on image. When I click on that, you can see image without content description. My next video will be about this warning and will be telling you how to remove that warning and increase the performance of your app. Back into our tutorial, I'm now running my application in a Genymotion emulator. This is the app with image. This is a simple tutorial to add an image view into your app. You can add an image according to your preferred dimensions. If you need any Android tutorials, please comment below. I will be active in the comment section. I will come up with the next video. Thanks for watching.